Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to my stupid supermarket. I don't want to go to work today. This is truly just a nightmare to look at. Uh, yeah, I think we have a lot of work to do in the old supermarket today. We have to restock the place. Uh, if you did miss the last episode, well, as you can see, you missed a lot. You should go check it out, because as per usual, I'm not going to explain what exactly has happened. As you can see, my cashiers, as per usual, are extremely happy to see me. But the store is looking better than it ever has, and I'm so excited to uh, finally get this thing set up perfectly. Everything has been strategized, and the shelves are looking great. Now we just need to bring all the product in and get my employees to do the rest of this. Oh, wait, I don't have employees because I fired them because they weren't doing anything, so I should probably rehire those guys. Welcome back to the club, guys. I got $70 to my name. We have a lot of work to do. And by we, I mean, well, I guess I do too, because I have to bring all the stupid boxes over. So you guys haven't updated yet to bring boxes in from outside. Oh, well, that took over an hour. That was fun. Oh, but at least my store should be fully stocked now. I'm doing okay stocking this as well. I didn't really go into this with a plan, but as you can see, we're pretty much maxed out in most areas in my storage as well. So, I haven't actually been in here, but everything better be stocked. This is so satisfying to see. Uh, let's just get rid of the empty boxes. Okay, and yeah, everything is looking good. I'm just going to take one double check to ensure that everything is stocked. But yeah, we all have a fully stocked store right now. And we'll go over to my computer here and just make sure... Oh, uh, this mod that I added is just so nice. It even changes the color of the um, text if you really need to buy something. So by quick glance, this should be pretty easy to figure out. <laughs> I think we'll be okay for yogurt for a while. I do have a few things that are not in stock, so we will have to worry about that. But it's looking like, just to confirm, everything is indeed in the store. And yes, indeed it is. So we're finally going to open up. I got to earn some serious cash right now. So uh, yeah, hopefully the new customers like the new layout. And I'm going to slowly work on my storage as we go about. I think I'll expand my chicken over to this only because we can only hold so many. I know I have chicken somewhere in here. This is a problem. I should have actually strategize the layout of this as well well it seems like demand is going very very well as you can see we're only at the start of the day usually it's not this populated so maybe the layout does dictate demand i have no idea i'm just changing my prices back i was using penetration pricing before just to try and get as much stock out of my store as possible not anymore though we're here to earn a profit now damn it so we are selling as much as we possibly can okay it took me all day to price check Check every item in my store but we are all even now and yeah demand has been maxed throughout the store and by quick glance the high ticket item has been this cheese for whatever reason that's why i love fully stocking the store because you can kind of see what's in demand what was that that guy said something and i don't know oh the checkouts are full dude this is a major problem i've never had double full checkouts this is so great so i hope it did pay off any more high demand items? I mean, the Susu always seems to do all right, but nothing insane besides that cheese, it seems like. Uh, yeah, everything else seems to be pretty chill. Oh my God, there's still people shopping in my store. I'm not, I'm not joking. I've been waiting like 10 minutes. I can technically finish the day, but my there's so much demand that my uh, checkout is taking forever. This lady, okay, she just cashed out. I think that's everybody that's been wandering the store besides stalkers, of course. Okay, so after this, they're done. And I'm super excited to try out this new mod to restock tomorrow. We'll see what we need. Okay, and the final one. There we go. I just want to see, was there any missing products today? Products not found one. Oh, that's going to forever bother me. What am, what, what am I missing? Am I missing anything? Was he just dumb and couldn't find the product? I don't know, but I guess we'll find out today. Milk and toilet paper is down. Okay, dealt with the pricing. Now with this new mod, let's go quickly glance and see what we need. So pretty much anything with a red name, we have to assume we're going to need a little bit of. So yeah, this is just so much better by quick glance to see what I actually need. Okay, there's a lot more items than I thought. I might regret this, but I'm going to buy them all at once again. Nothing bad happened last time. So 25 items, only 655 bucks. So rather cheap items. And there we go. Is that new? No, that, one, that one's been there. Can I actually grab that? Hold on. Nope. All right, but not too bad. That's one day worth of resupply. 
So we'll throw these in the old inventory as I try and organize things and uh, start the day again. Actually, instead of uh, trying to figure out where everything is, I'm going to spend more money and finally get these final two racks. So we are utilizing pretty much as much of this space as we can possibly do. Oh, sorry. I actually get four racks. That's right. Uh, it's two on each side. Okay, store is looking great. We have restocked. I actually bought some new shelving. I'm going to have to move all these racks over just a little bit because I need, I'm need. i actually maxing out my space. I can't actually fit uh, these things side by side. So I got to slide this rack over ever so slightly. And it looks like even these racks as well. We got to get these as close to the wall unless we want to expand out this area again. All right, as you can see, I got about, I don't know, a couple inches of space. That should hopefully be what I need to get double racks on these. Come on, baby, get in there. Oh, yeah, we got lots of room. It's just super satisfying to perfectly uh, utilize all this space. So I'm going to buy two more racks just because why not? We need to get to level 30 to move on to the next stage of the game. That is more products. I'm super excited for 30, though, because uh, we're going to get into alcohol then. And if Canada has told me anything, alcohol sells very, very well. And it's probably very profitable as well. So that's a big goal of mine to get to alcohol. Okay, now I'm definitely thinking, what is going on? How am I missing products? Again, products. Oh, you know what? That's the... Ignore me on that one. Salmon, pizza mix, and veal chops. Salmon, pizza mix, and veal chops. Uh, it's because I ran out of freaking chicken. So yeah, as I said, I do want to expand out the chicken. I'm also going to expand out my potatoes because I ran out of those as well. And again, we are selling so much every day. It's actually kind of overwhelming. I'm just going to get one of everything that we still have in my storage. Uh, toilet paper. I think we actually should be okay. We haven't been selling a lot of toilet paper for whatever reason, so I'm fine with that. We're selling a lot of other things. So yeah, as you can see, chicken and potatoes, we are totally out of. I bought five of each, so that should be good. And I'm going to expand out both of their racks. I don't remember. I put the potatoes right here. So, huh, how am I going to expand out? We got room. I'm just going to have to move things around a bit. Actually, it probably makes more sense to put the potatoes here anyways. So we'll have a full shelf of potatoes and we can already expand out the chicken. No big deal. Well, that's a fancy hair color, isn't it, lady? Uh, that is just one lady. I'm not sure what has happened to her hair. Anyways, little update as you can see, demand is still insane throughout the roof. I gotta get the third cashier as quickly as possible, but uh, I believe that's level 30. So that's the big goal right now. 29 and 30, we can hire a stalker at 29, a cashier at 30, and we get two new different products for our shelves. Well, I think 12 total at 30 as well. But yeah, things are going well. Slowly and surely, I'm earning some money. I have been organizing my stock as well, but it's still, as you can see, absolutely insane. Hey, you're not allowed back here. <laughs> Why are you leaving that way? I don't think I've ever seen anyone do that. Oh, that's great. Okay, so we just passed $11,000. I didn't really want to expand this out just yet. I'm just morbidly curious which way we are going to expand our store now. Is it going to continue lengthwise or is it going to widen out? I was hoping to buy all three before I upgraded, but I'd have to wait till level 37 for that. And I just want to see what happens. We also have to remember I'm getting a new cashier soon. Oh, okay. So it is widening. So we got that little area over there. I guess I could make this my secret office for the time being. <laughs> That's actually good, though. Uh, if I could expand out one more, this will be great for all my rows of uh, products. Because I could just expand out this way instead of having to lengthen this even more. Not that I really can anymore. I've maxed out my uh, space here pretty much. So yeah, I think I'm going to hopefully buy the other one too and uh, expand that out when we reach that level, which is probably pretty far away, isn't it? Level 31, not as far as I thought, actually. We're going to need $16,500 for that though. So quite a bit of money. So until then, there's no real sense in expanding this. I can't really do much over here. This could be a good alcohol area, though, uh, later on. I now have a legit office with a front view. I feel very special right now. <laughs> well, we have hit level 29, uh, which is good news. That means we... Oh, I got to get used to that. I have a new office now. I have upgraded. I even added a small light to my office. How nice. But yes, we can get our first new employee of this episode... So welcome to the club restocker number three. We actually could utilize that, but I'm very excited for the cashier. 
who should be coming in a little bit now. 30 is going to be a huge level. We'll be able to uh, get our third cashier as well as our uh, biggest investment of new items in a long time. Well, that third counter could not come fast enough. It is getting worse and worse. Obviously, I could take to the cashier but it's actually taking me the whole day to restock everything with how much uh, people are buying. Good problem to have again. But even my stalkers, as you can see, are having a hard time keeping up. We have everything stocked in the uh, storage. There's just so much demand. <laughs> Look at the boys go. All in a line and everything. I just, I've been waiting like 10 minutes plus just to end my day. I mean, yes, I could buy an extra cashier and I should have did that, but I can't anymore because you only buy things at nine in this game. And when it reaches nine, you can't. But yeah, I think I'm definitely going to buy a cash re register for tomorrow to at least pop up for the end of the day chaos. Did my freaking worker quit? Did you just give up on me, my dude? What is going on here, bud? No wonder why it's taking forever. I didn't even see this till now. He has quit. I am so sorry, sir. Yeah, you're going to have to do the, the rest of this. <laughs> I, mean, I have no choice. Maybe if I grab this, this is a bad idea. This is always a bad idea. I can't I can't put it back down. I knew this was a bad idea. Damn it. All right, so screw it. This day has been ruined. I'm just going to finish my day, and hopefully he pops back up tomorrow. Oh, great. Nope. All right, everything's back in order. We've had to reload this thing. Back to opening. I think I should have a purchase queued up for today's demands, which aren't too bad. And I got my new checkout counter. So tonight, even if my guy does decide to quit, we should be okay. Oh, hello? Uh, okay. Am I checking out a ghost? Thought I'd pop this up early today just to help out. Where, where are you? Oh God, it broke. It, it freaking broke. No. Hey, are you the person who's giving me money? What the hell? So yeah, it actually broke. I am... Okay, hold on, hold on. Lady, come back, please. I am sorry. What is going on here? Ah? Ah, is it gonna work this time? Welcome to the secret checkout. The much faster checkout so you don't have to waste your time. Because my employees suck in this thing, damn game. No change, nice. Thank you very much. Have a good day, sir. Welcome. That's a weird purchase, but okay. You know, it's kind of peaceful back here. Not many customers come this way it's almost like they can't find it or something it's not too bad every now and then one pops up buys a crap load of things as you can see and voila i've just earned 85 dollars well i guess not technically i did have to buy those items but probably like 50 bucks hello three dollars and 42 cents i'm rich at this point i'm just way too lazy to deal change just get a free dollar there you go you found the secret checkout you get a tip Oh man, lady, why do you gotta buy three chickens? My store can only hold eight, I believe. So there goes my whole stock. Oh God, it's turning dark time. Yes, that that's what I call night. I don't wanna have to walk all the way over to get the damn switch. Well, we're almost there. Am I gonna get the big level 30 checkout? I hope so. Hold on here, I can't really see very well, but it's romantic, you know? You found the secret counter. We got romantic lighting back here. It's nice. And I didn't get it, damn it. Come on. More customers, please. I want to be the one that gets the big level 30, damn it. Nobody is coming back. I don't think I'm going to get the big level 30. Come on, just one customer. Come around the corner, please. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, sorry. I just closed the counter. <laughs> I was like, screw it. I hit 30. I don't want to check out anymore. It is nice you can close them down now before you couldn't do that. All right, but 30 is a very big day. We're going to have a lot to deal with tomorrow. Because I'm purchasing not one, but two different licenses, and one is alcohol. That's super exciting. That's so many more products I got to deal with. So with that in mind, I think I'm going to upgrade my storage as well. It's pretty much maxed out. I could upgrade it twice if I wanted to, but that would be all my money, and that would be dumb. Actually, you know what? Screw it. I am going to purchase two. I know that's all my money, but I can get a loan in this game if I want to. That did not expand as I expected. Oh, it did. It just was delayed. That was weird. So it looks like we should be able to get at least one more row in here. I don't think there's going to be room for two rows, uh, but that's looking real nice. And what's even nicer... Oh, I don't have enough money right now. Hold on. How much money do I need? God damn it. <laughs> Wait. Why can't I hire him? Oh, no. Oh, no. I didn't read that. Oh, my God. I have to check out 500 people. 400. Sorry. Math's hard. 
That's pretty much double what I've done. Oh, why didn't I know about that? I would have been checking out so many people. Well, I guess I'm the new checkout hiree. Oh, that's going to be rough. So, uh, yeah, we're going to have to check out people. I have no choice. Not that that's a bad thing. It actually did help out a lot to deal with the demand. So, yeah, I think now is a good time to wrap up this episode here, guys. We did a lot in this episode. Things are going much better, as you can see. Next episode, we're obviously going to have to restock those 12 new items. And, uh, yeah, continue where we left off. Hopefully, we can expand out that full wall so we can expand out our store fully. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to have to check out 400 people in the next episode as well. So that's going to be fun. As always, guys, thanks for watching and liking. And I'll see you in the next one. Hey there. Before you go, I just wanted to let you know about my second channel, Gast. If you're missing my multiplayer shenanigans, then please consider checking it out. Scan the QR code or copy the link down below. Okay, bye. Captain! It's too bizarre. Why am I bizarre? What's wrong? That face is too... It's it's too messy. Here, put the smiler on. Somebody show him. Up here. Oh, my God. No, I'm keeping it.